What it do, Ski Baby? It's your boy Mitchell G, man. Today, I'm going to show you guys how I personally package a shirt for my clothing company, man. So stay tuned. All right, guys. So if you guys are a startup clothing company just like myself, you're probably wondering, you know, how do you package a t-shirt or a tank top or maybe even a hoodie um, to make it look professional when you're making a sale you know so uh, in this video right here we're gonna show you guys how I personally uh, package my t-shirts and uh, I hope it helps you guys out man all right guys now before we do get into this video man I just wanted to introduce myself my name is Mitchell Gonzalez uh, founder and CEO of Royal Dream Supply so basically I started in 2014 we fell down got back up you know trial and error experimental marketing and stuff like that if you want to call it but uh you know fast forward to 2018 we're finally ready to launch our website and uh you know that's a very exciting moment for me because you know this is a dream come true to me you know this is something i've wanted to do since i was a little kid i grew up in a skate shop in southern california man so ever since then it's been embedded in my brain you know that i wanted to create a brand unfortunately it took a very long time but fortunately i'm doing it you know what i mean it's not something that i regret you know what i mean because we're doing it in the making so basically if you guys want to follow a startup company that's gonna blow up this is the channel right here man because we taking this to another level and i promise you guys man we're not gonna stop until we hit the world so if you guys want to see that make sure you subscribe make sure you like make sure you hit that bell so you can get notified man let's get it all right guys so the first item i'm going to show you guys is the poly bag here it's uh i forgot what size this is but it fits a t-shirt maybe even two depending on how you fold your t-shirts but uh it's a very good size um you can also fit a hat in here like a you know maybe like an unstructured dad hat or something a beanie socks um very good size and it's also resealable so you can open this up from here and um you know just remove that right there and it has an adhesive so you can close it and it'll stick and you can reopen it as well all right guys so the next tool that i use here is the hole puncher it's not your traditional size hole punch um this one is actually a 1 8 which is a lot smaller if you look at that little turquoise dot right there that's what size it is and what i use this tool for is my hang tags so uh basically um i use this hole punch to make a hole on the hang tags um, and to put our hang tag string in it and connect it to the t-shirt. So uh, I'll show you guys that in a minute. All right, next we have the Royal Dreams business cards. Basically, this is a squared shape. I believe it's a 2.5 by 2.5 squared business card that I purchased on vistaprint.com. Um, I got about 500 of these for, I believe it was $40 or less. But the front, I ordered it shiny and the back was just a flat color. Um, I put my Instagram, Facebook, and Snapchat, my website, and our email address for the brand. So these came out really, really nice. They give it a, a very good look, very modern look on the clothing and your hats and stuff like that. All right, so I usually put it on the top center and uh, it doesn't have to be perfect as long as it's centered and on the top. So this is what it looks like with the hole in it. Now it's a hang tag instead of a business card. So what's cool about these is you can hand them out, you know, socially as a business card and you can also put them on your clothing. So this is pretty cool and very affordable. All right, guys. So next up, we got our Royal Dream stickers. These are rectangular shaped, as you can see. Uh, they are about twice the size, you know, of the business card lengthwise which is a decent size. If you guys, uh, you know, are barely starting out and are, you are, and you're on a budget, you know, I would suggest put one sticker per item and then one business card per item as well, along with the hang tag. So that would be a hang tag, a business card, and then one of these stickers. If you're doing it for a celebrity endorsement, I would suggest throwing everything in there, you know, one of each. And uh, if you're just doing it for a sale and you're barely starting out and you're on a budget, I would suggest just one of these. So you pick whatever color you want and then you just throw it in the poly bag along with the business card. I use the hang tag strings. 
I ordered these on Amazon. They're a pretty decent size. Um, and basically I use these to hang the hang tags. What you wanna do is you wanna put this tip in through the 1 8 circle. And here at the bottom, as you can see, there's a little entrance for the for the tip. Okay, so basically there's a little bump right on top here. You can barely see it, but uh, what you would wanna do is connect it to this little square and you hear it click. So once it clicks, it's good to go. And uh, that's the hang tag. The majority of the items here I ordered on Amazon, but this is a pear shape pen. You can use whatever shape you want, but this is my preference. Uh, I like the black, you know, it gives it a more modern style look. So this is what you would use to, you know, connect the hang tag to your item. So, uh, you know, we just put it on here. We would just let it fall like so. And then you would connect this to the t-shirt. And it doesn't affect the t-shirt at all. It's, it, I've tried it several times and it works perfectly. All right, so here we have our olive and black Royal Dreams classic t-shirt. And uh, we're gonna pin it up right on top here in the middle is where I usually put it. You can also pin it on one of the sleeves, whichever you prefer. Or, you know, you can also do it at the bottom as well. I'm just gonna put it up here on the top middle, like I said, very fast and easy so there it is now it's hanging all right guys so now that the shirt is ready to go with the hang tag we're gonna go ahead and fold it put it inside the poly bag throw some goodies in there close it up and then show you what the final product looks like all right guys so this right here that i'm doing is manually folding the shirt but you can also use a you know a shirt folder which you can get on amazon as well for like 15 to 25 dollars um you might even get them for cheaper than that but um I don't have mine at the moment, so I'm just gonna do it manually. But what I do is I try to get everything, uh, you know, as close as possible. For the sake of this video, I'm not gonna do it, you know, super uh, perfect. But, uh, you know, we're just gonna fold it to the point where we feel like it's good to fit inside this poly bag. But uh, I just usually fold it like one time right here. I fold this up. A little bit so you can kind of see the tag inside and then I work with it right here so you can uh, so you can see the entire logo on the front when you put it in the bag and make sure the tag is hanging out like that or you could tuck it in if you like whatever you prefer I usually like the show my hang tag i don't actually remember the size of this poly bag here but i will leave a link in the description so you can uh, check it out i believe i got these on amazon put it inside the poly bag so we're just going to slide it right in there Got to make sure we take out the lint. If you see any lint, make sure you remove it. And uh, all right, so now we have it in there. And uh, the next step would be to remove uh, this little strip here so we can have the adhesive. Make sure everything's good in the front. Now before we fold it, I would just throw in a couple stickers. I would throw in about two, depending on your budget, but I would throw in two business cards, two stickers. And then I would just fold it up. So once it's folded up, you just press it down to get the air out. And there you go. All right, so this is the final product here. So, uh, you know, this is very professional looking. You know, we got the hang tag hanging. The brand, you can see it very clearly. Um, you turn it around, and then you got your stickers here, your promotional stuff, your business card with your information. It looks very, very professional. Your customers would be really, really excited when they see this.
All right, guys, so that's how I personally package my t-shirts, and uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this content today. If you guys have a better way of doing so, man, maybe a better way of packaging it, maybe a cheaper way, but still looks professional, let me know down below. I'm always open to suggestions, and I will respond back to you. So if you guys are a startup clothing company, or maybe a fan of the brand, and you guys want to follow me, man, make sure you guys subscribe, man, because we got a lot more dope content coming. I got a better camera on the way. Uh, we got a lot of stuff, man. Uh, our website launches this summer. Uh, we're super stoked about it, man. Um, <laughs> I just hope you guys tag along, man, because we're going to blow up, man. So make sure you tune in. Peace.